two games tomorrow. It's the first double header that's happening tomorrow. It's Sunday, and uh, it's two games. Yeah, well, there you go. The first one, Bangalore playing uh, Kolkata. That's happening in Chennai as well. Same place where this uh, game happened, and then the action shifts in the evening to Mumbai, and uh, that's where you see the second game of the day, where it's Delhi playing Punjab. So that's uh, the game that's happening then. Let's uh, talk briefly about uh, both gentlemen, if we can. Let's talk about uh, Bangalore and uh, Kolkata first. Uh, Simon, Bangalore, Bangalore looking good so far. Yeah, they are. They, they've, um, I think they've found a recipe, and, and you know, I've been really impressed with what Glenn Maxwell has done, how he started for them. We know that the quality of Virat Kohli will shine through at some stage through the tournament. Not surfaces that really suit him in Chennai at the moment, but they're finding a way. And it's all around that bowling attack, I think. They're just slowly, you know, they're getting better results out of that bowling attack. Hushal Patel has been a, a revelation for them, which has been good. One guy who, who I think needs improvement and, and has just fallen away a little bit is Yuzi, isn't he? Yuzi Vendra Chahal. He hasn't quite been at his best in the first couple of games. I'm trying to figure out whether they could make a change and, and perhaps get um, Adam Zampa in for Dan Christian. I know I built Dan Christian up in the last game, but I wonder whether there might be uh, room for for some change in that um, realm. They've already got, you know, if you play Siraj, Jamison and um, Harshal Patel, you've got three seamers or two seamers and one of those and maybe get Zampa in. No, Sam's Sam's comes out as well, I think. I think Sam's is Sam's is out. out. Sam's came out today. Sam's is out, out of uh, quarantine today. So he's he probably wouldn't have had any, uh, any, uh, any practice behind him. I, I don't I don't think they're going to make a change though, uh, Harsha, because this is the team that has been criticised in the past for chopping and changing too much. Mm-hmm. Chehel has been one of their kingpins, so I really doubt if they're going to drop Chehel just after two games. Do so you think that they'd, they'd kind of look at that? There's one other thing. It's an afternoon game. No, as of now, you've got to balance. Uh, the reason people were bowling, uh, were uh, putting the other side in was the dew. Now, this is an afternoon game in Chennai. There's not going to be any dew. So it's straight away win the toss, bat first. The track will get slower and slower because the afternoon sun will be beating on it from about 3.30 to 5.36. Yep. So it will get slower and slower and slower. So win the toss, bat first and try and strangle in the second innings. I think that's going to be the way. Uh, for the and, and I'm not talking about dropping Uzi. I'm talking about playing Zampa instead of Christian and playing the two leggies, both. So you're oh, just so giving, you yourself, think, oh, okay. yeah, yeah. You're just giving oh. yourself another leg spin option. I think um, you know that, that might be a way with an afternoon game, guaranteed no wet ball. Like Harsha says, that maybe it's an opportunity to bring another spinner into play. That's really interesting because then you also have Washington Sundar's overs uh-huh. and perhaps get Glenn Maxwell if he bowls at all, right? So, and Shabazz. And, and Shabazz. Shabazz. Oh, you got mm. 20 overs of spin there. If you want. <laughs> and what you want. <laughs> what they could do is pick an Indian batsman maybe because I think, I think Christian on the slow, sluggish ball stop coming may not be the same mm. finisher that he is on other grounds. Maybe, yeah. maybe throw someone like an Azaruddin in and say, look, we've, we've got a decent batting side actually. So yeah. go in there and we'll treat you as a gamble. You're an Indian batsman on these slowish tracks. You've got a better chance and play the two leggies. Yeah. Mm. Is Zampa out of, uh, out, out of uh, quarantine though? Because he can't. Yeah, he is. He's available. He's nice. available for okay. selection. Okay. Sam's is available. So I think the mm-hmm. entire squad pretty much is available. Uh, Sam's takes pace off as well, doesn't he? Yeah, left armor can take pace off. Absolutely. He did well in the Big Bash. He only played a couple of games for Delhi last year before they traded him uh, to Bangalore, but uh, was uh, pretty decent in the Big Bash. All right, let's have a look at the Kolkata team and uh, see if uh, the Knight Riders would like to make uh, any changes in their lineup. Harsha? I don't think so. They won, they won, they won their last game. Yeah. They're batting okay in the, in the top order. So I, I don't they, see... they lost to Mumbai, right? The last they lost one? Their last game. Yeah, oh, they sorry, lost they their last game. They couldn't chase. Yeah, they couldn't chase. Yeah, uh, yeah. That that's when they all uh, uh, Shakib and all the Shakib and Morgan yes. and the others played those big shots. Yeah. Let's look at it from that point of view. How how are they placed on slow bowling? They've got Varun Chakravarti. They've got Harbhajan Singh, who who bowls, who's the first over specialist. They've got Shakib. I think that's good enough actually. And then uh, R- Russell at the end, uh, the pace of Cummins mm-hmm. and Prasid Krishna. It's, it's it's all right that attack. Simon. Yeah, look, I mean, Shakib hasn't done a lot in the first couple of games. Um, it was disappointing. Mm-hmm. Do they get Narayan and do they give Narayan an opportunity? Um, when, when, they, when their venues change, I can see Lockie Ferguson playing a part down the track for them. But at the moment, it's that toss up between Sunil Narayan and, and Shakib Al Hassan. They would have expected more out of Shakib with the bat in the first couple of games than they've had. 
Hmm. So would they make a change? If they do make a change, perhaps the only one you can think of mm. is uh, Sunil Narayan coming uh, in place of uh, Shaki. It also creates more confusion for them because uh, this Chennai surface, you want an opener who can go real hard at the top. Nitish Rana has been doing that job for them. But if they put Sunil Narayan in top, then again, the same musical chairs of their batting order comes back up again. The rush if, he plays, if he plays, he's got to bat down the order. I think that the, the time has come for Sunil Narayan to go back to being a bowler who probably doesn't bat. At all. <laughs> well, you know what he did last year, right? He yeah, last he opened, he batted at five, at four, at three, everywhere, at yeah. three as well. So he did everything well. Uh, yeah, well, so that's uh, Kolkata and Bangalore. That's also the first. Exactly 13 years. Gone exactly 13 years since that start of the IPL tomorrow. Ah, and that, 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 was, that was Bangalore. And that's versus McCallum Kolkata as well. That oh. was Bangalore versus Kolkata as well. Ah, they've planned it like that, haven't they? And Brendan McCollum's there as well. Well, you never know what's going to happen. All right, uh, the second I, I'm, I'm not doing the show. I'm not doing the show, but I'm going to guess that they score 158 total. <laughs> 158 part of our part of folklore. <laughs> Correct. Nice. 